Welcome to part two of AI Made Simple. If you missed part one, check the link in the description. Let's dive in. Now that we know all of the different learning models, let's take a look at some of the different types of AI. There are three main categories of AI. First, there is narrow AI, also known as weak AI. This is the type of AI that is already being used in many applications like self-driving cars, for example. Narrow AI is designed to perform only one task, and it cannot perform any other tasks outside of its programming. The second type is general AI, or strong AI. This is the type of AI that we see in movies like Terminator and The Matrix. General AI would be able to perform any intellectual task that a human can do. But as of now, this type of AI does not exist yet. And finally, there is superintelligence AI. This is an AI that is much smarter than humans and has its own consciousness. Currently, this type of AI exists only in science fiction books and movies. There are also many subcategories of AI, including robotics, machine vision, natural language processing, and expert systems. But no matter what type of AI it is, all AI systems work towards the same goal, which is to make machines think and act like humans. AI is changing the world around us in big and small ways, from helping doctors diagnose diseases earlier to making sure that our homes are safe. AI is everywhere, and it's becoming more and more important every day. As AI gets smarter and more capable, it will continue to change the way we live, work, and play. So it's important that we understand how it works so that we can use it to make our lives better. This was a big topic, so feel free to pause, rewind, and replay any part of this video that you didn't quite understand. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. Who knows? You might just help someone else learn something new. That's a wrap for today. Can't wait to see you in the next video. Until then, take care.